So, <clears throat> you have to excuse me. I washed my face and I have like bio oil on my face because I've been breaking out and I have scars. So, this normally helps my scars fade. But anyway, I'm about to dye my hair. I'm trying to go blonde. We'll see. We'll see how this turns out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. These were all the supplies that I picked up from the Sally's by my house. And so, um, I know like for my, um, I didn't know if I wanted T18 or T15, but, um, so I got them both. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna use this all. But this is like the purple shampoo. They said that this was probably like the best one to get like the yellow brassy tones and stuff out. I normally use shimmering lights or whatever. I like got this one instead because this was a bit more moisturizing of a developer and it smells good so mixing that with this bleach um a lot of people a lot of women of color say that they prefer this bleach for their hair so that's why i grabbed this all these items were let's see were 129 dollars and 34 cents and so yeah these like the shower caps my mixing bowl this is stuff that i already had like as you can see you see a little bit of dye on this from when i dyed my hair black um some argon oil packets some repair and deep conditioner especially because i'm about to go blonde and yeah just so you guys know i'm not a professional don't claim to be so don't play i'm probably going to start on this side because this back isn't as thick but i'm about to mix the bleach powder and stuff i'm about to mix everything together and see what we can get before I get started. Okay, so I mixed all my developer and then I added the, the uh, color, the absolute perfection booster. I added some of it to the bleach because I'm going to add the um, I'm gonna add the rest probably when I'm like when I'm toning, and so I didn't want to use the entire thing of that. My counter is so I'm honestly just going to go in and use my use my fingers honestly but I'm not I'm gonna try to avoid going to the roots right now I'm not trying to go to the roots so I'm trying to start at the bottom
when, when did I get on the phone with you? That wasn't even 20 minutes ago, was it? Mm-hmm. Now I just gotta do the roots. I mean, it's bleach. It ain't like it's hair dye. I do. But... Now, why did I let this bitch peer pressure my grown ass to bleach my motherfucking eyebrows? They ain't look bad, but at the end of the day, like, bitch, I shouldn't have listened to her just because she told me to. Girl, it's getting very much ramen noodles. Mm -hmm. But I, um, yeah, I put that little, what is this called? Like, one of these, the argon oil mask in, the um, repair deep conditioner in. After I rinse out this bleach, I'm about to. I'm about to rinse this shit out. I'm about to go get some gloves. And then I'm gonna try to tone it. I'm gonna start toning it. So it was in this moment where I decided that I wasn't even gonna tone my hair because the toners that I had, I just knew that it wasn't gonna do shit for this orange and yellow ass color. So I tried to do like a little bit of purple shampoo to see how much of the brassiness I could get out before I could get back to Sally's tomorrow to um, get like a whole new color. And so, um, yeah, like I just tried to get as much as I could because it's not giving Beyonce right now. It's giving very much Roman noodles. And so right now I try to use the purple shampoo. It really didn't do that much, but I'll show you what it looked like after. So this is what it's looking like for right now with no product. I'm about to add a, I'm gonna add another deep conditioner in it and then leave that in. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna add the deep conditioner and some oils. These two and the oil. Okay, so I'm on my way to Sally's right now, bitch. I got this motherfucking hat on because who the fuck about to catch me out here looking stupid? Nami? Nami? And Nami? So I'm about to go to Sally's. I watched a couple videos to figure out how to get the breast in out, and I think I found a solution. So I'm going to go pick up the Wella T14 and 050 and get like maybe a 20 or 10 developer, but I'm going to use the Ion one because is for sensitive scalps and i'll come back with the ugly look how my hair is my sister thinks that this color is so cute bitch no we're not going with this okay so i'm gonna tell her i'm probably gonna do like my little curly bang game so i'll probably wear like and she's like mm -mm, you're gonna be looking like rick james bitch i'm gonna be looking like rick james with blonde hair so Girl, look at my fucking roots. This is just crazy. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all what I got real quick. Okay, okay so I went to Sally's again, and 
this time I grabbed a 20 volume developer, but I got the Eon sensitive scalp one because this is way better. It's not as harsh um, as like the other ones that people be using. I grabbed one of these even though I have it already, but it's a sensitive scalp protector and it's the color brilliance. Um, yeah, scalp protector, or whatever. So I'm using that. And then I got the Wella T14 in the Wella 050. I'm going to be mixing these two. I'm going to use the whole bottle of T14 and then I'm going to fill up the bottle with 20 volume developer and then pour that in. And then I'm going to use half of the 050, not the full bottle, but I feel like if I do these two, um, it's going to cancel out the orange and the yellow tones because on the color wheel, I want to say that like, you know, purple and blue is like a, purple is across from like the yellow and orangish color. So, fingers crossed that this is going to cancel everything out. <laughs> and this time, like I said, I'm going to be using the, <clears throat> 20 developer. I feel like I could have used, um, I probably could have used, uh, what is it called? 10 developer, but I just grabbed the 20 just in case. So, like I said, I'm gonna go. Why the fuck would I do that? Just stupid. So, I'm gonna use the whole bottle of the T14. Woo! And the reason why I'm not using the whole 050 is because. I don't want it. I don't want like this shit to be like overly icy. Like, because I think a 050 is what turns your hair like gray, that silver color. And we're not going for that. So I'm just gonna eyeball this to. Um, you could go like maybe right here. Just don't exceed, don't exceed 50. Don't exceed half of the bottle, I guess I should say. So I'm gonna keep eyeballing it. Okay, so that should be fine. And then a 20 developer, so I can mix this together. And so here's my T14 bottle, let me pour the rest of that in there. And then, yeah. Okay. And then I'm pouring that into my bowl. So, oh, also, I'm going to take this and then I'm going to add that in as well because this is going to help with like preventing your hair from getting like, you know, damaged any more than it can already be from bleaching it. Um, About 
It looks dark, but I know it's not gonna be dark. So. All right, this is what it's looking like before I rinse it out, and then I'll be back. <laughs> now, this is what it's looking like. I'm about to go in with some Blonde Brilliant Ash Blonde Lathering Toner, and, and this is extra strength or whatever, so this is like shampoo. I'm about to go in with this, and then come back and show you the color. Oh, I actually like this. I like this, bitch. Okay, it's hope after all. Like I said, I'm going in with a little purple shampoo. And it's just toning it. But like, I like how I don't see any more, I don't really see any orange colors. Look at my shirt, it's just dirty. It's almost like a silky bitch. But I like this way better, cause girl, that yellow and that orange was not the fuck cutting it. And I was surprised because you know I was running out. The only thing I will say is that I should have, I should have got two bottles of the T14 because my hair was too long and so I ran out. That's why you see me taking parts out and like putting it to the other side. But yeah, I'm like that. Girl. And this, um, this purple shampoo is really moisturizing. Actually, I mean, yeah, I like this. It's really moisturizing. It's like doesn't make my hair feel dry or like it's stripping it. But I like this. I hopefully it's gonna come out really cute after I style it. Woo! Cause my hair was looking crazy. <laughs> I was looking crazy. But yeah, it's not too bad. So as you can see, my hair is not yellow or orange anymore. Um, but my hair is still wet, and so that's the reason why it's so, um, it looks really, really uh, dark right now. But I know like once I dry it and I style it and everything, it's going to be lighter. But I am definitely about to, um, I'm about to put like a deep conditioner, like I'm mask. I'm gonna do this in my hair, and then I'm going to put a shower cap on it. So I can treat my hair and then I'm going to uh, take a shower, get cleaned up, maybe do. Um, and then like may probably like diffuse my hair and stuff, like style it and then come back with the end result. So I'll probably show you what it looks like in the in the daylight. Since it looks really, really dark right right now. And then yeah, like I said, I'll be back with my end end results. And yeah, okay. So this is, oh shit, let me turn the brightness down a little bit. So this is like in the sunlight. These are my end results. How do you guys like it? Not what you expected, but I know that the T, the T14 and the 050 cancels out the orange and yellow tones. And so um, this is what I'm left with. Okay. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye, guys. Go do I think I need you.